Hey, this is the DIY Magician with another grab bag special. We go to thrift stores and we find the grab bags. We bring them back here. We open them up. And we have fun in the process. So hang on. We'll be right back. Here's another bag, another grab bag special. Uh, this one's cool because it has something that I couldn't believe. I when I went through, I think you'll uh, if you see the video of me going through the um, the what do they call it the uh, thrift store treasure hunt uh, series. Um, I actually was very surprised when I got this uh, bag because it it's all these toys. And then this big giant like maple leaf brass something or other. So I had to buy it. I had to buy it. Um, in fact, I'm going to open it right now, get out the uh, maple leaf because it is solid. Um, oh, wow. Uh, I, I totally mistook the, uh, the date. It says 1950. 1950. It is a sugar maple, sugar maple. Uh, this is pretty darn cool. Uh, it is some sort of maybe, um, I don't know if it would be an ashtray, maybe an ashtray, but uh, it's pretty darn cool. It's very massively weighted and um, it's pretty cool. So I'm pretty jazzed. That's a pretty cool find. But now we've got a bag of toys then we got to figure out what's in here. So this is cool because I don't know what it is. Okay, so here we have a clown nose. Look at that. Look at that. A clown nose. It is like a hard foam clown nose. Uh, it's It uh, squeezes uh, right there like that, and you just kind of put the tip of your nose in there. And, oh, it stinks too. Ah, there's a clown nose. Okay. In addition to the clown nose, we have a baby rattle. That's a neat noise. It's like a watch winder. So if you had to uh, wind your watch and you go. Look at that. That's pretty cool. It's got all sorts of little... Like a hit. I'm going to use that as a sound effect. Listen to that. Pretty cool. It's a watch winder. All right. So then we've got these little, uh, uh, looks like the little toys that you clip together. I have enough to make something fun. Let's do this. Actually, let's flip it upside down. 